The construction of the brushless servo motor is very similar to that of the step motor. Both contain a rotor assembly consisting of a turned shaft with laminations and permanent magnets, and both have stators containing motor windings on a lamination stack within a machined extruded housing. Changes in material and motor design technologies have had a significant impact on the servo motor industry. The development of rare earth magnets made of neodymium iron boron has increased magnet strengths by 200 to 300 percent. And the development of new motor winding insertion techniques has created slotless and bridged motor designs, both of which are optimized for improved performance and manufacturability. The typical brushless servo motor uses a traditional or slotted lamination which consists of a series of teeth with slots between the teeth. It is these slots into which the stator windings are inserted from the inside of the stator. In the slotless design, the slotted lamination has been replaced by a ring lamination which eliminates the presence of slots on the inside of the stator. The fundamental difference between the slotless and slotted designs is that the slotless design has both a larger rotor diameter, therefore a larger rotor inertia, and a lower winding inductance. Because the stator windings are no longer wound in slots around steel cores inside the stator, as they are in the conventional design, there is now more space available to accommodate a larger rotor diameter. The larger rotor creates the opportunity to incorporate more magnet material on the rotor. The lower winding inductance occurs because there is no steel core to interfere with the inductance field which develops around the windings. When the motor diameter exceeds three inches, the additional cost of the rotor magnet material begins to offset the savings gained by the simplified slotless design. To address the issue of simplifying manufacturing and reducing costs in the larger motors, a second motor design called the bridged design has been developed. In this design, the conventional slotted and toothed lamination has been replaced with a two-piece lamination. The outer piece is a ring lamination, similar to the one used in the slotless design. A second inner lamination that resembles a spider is also used. This inner lamination has teeth and slots. However, the slot opening that is traditionally on the inside diameter is closed, and the slot opening is moved to the outside diameter. The stator winding can now be inserted into the inner lamination from the outside, again, greatly simplifying the insertion process. The wound inner lamination is then inserted into the outer ring lamination. Because this design follows a conventional toothed design, except for the method of construction, it does not have an increased rotor diameter when compared to the slotted design. This design is called bridged due to the bridge between the teeth on the inside diameter of the lamination where the slot opening traditionally exists. Common to all brushless servo motor designs, commutation is performed electronically by using rotor position information derived from a shaft mounted device which is then fed back to the servo drive. For example, the electronic commutation device might include Hall effect sensors for low resolution or six state commutation, or a resolver for high resolution or sinusoidal commutation, or even an absolute encoder, which depending on the resolution can provide six state or sinusoidal commutation.